വെൽക്കം ബാക്ക് ടു ഡി ഫാർമസി ഡിസ്കഷൻ ഫാർമസിസ്റ്റ് ക്ലേഡി ടു രണ്ടായിരത്തി ഇരുപത് സിലബസ് വൈസ് ഡിസ്കഷൻ ആണ് കണ്ടിന്യൂ ചെയ്യുന്നത് ഫാർമസ്യൂട്ടിക്കൽ കെമിസ്ട്രി വണ്ണിൽ ഒരു പോർഷൻ കൂടി സിലബസ് അനുസരിച്ച് ഡിസ്കസ് ചെയ്യാൻ ബാലൻസ് ഉണ്ട് സോ ഇന്നത്തെ ടോപ്പിക് അതാണ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ആൻറ്റിഡോട്ട്സ് ആൻഡ് ഇൻഓർഗാനിക് ഒഫീഷ്യൽ കോമ്പൗണ്ട്സ് ഓഫ് അയൺ ആയിഡിൻ ആൻഡ് കാൽഷ്യം വളരെ ചെറിയൊരു ടോപ്പിക്കാണ് ഡിപ്ലോമ ലെവലിൽ വളരെ കുറച്ച് പോയിൻറ്റ്സ് മാത്രമാണ് ഇൻക്ലൂഡ് ചെയ്തിട്ടുള്ളത് ഇവിടെ ആൻറ്റി ഡോട്ട്സിൽ സോഡിയം നൈട്രൈറ്റ് മാത്രമാണ് ഇൻക്ലൂഡ് ചെയ്തിരിക്കുന്നത് ഓക്കെ ദെൻ ലെറ്റ്സ് മൂവിങ് ഓൺ ടു ടുഡേസ് ടോപ്പിക് നൗ യു ക്യാൻ ഗോ ത്രൂ ദ ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻസ് Okay, let's check out the answers. First question from antidote. Synonym for sodium nitrite. Answer, nitrous acid, sodium salt. Then question number 2. Chemical name for sodium nitrite. Answer, NaNO2. Then third question. Sodium nitrite is prepared by heating the nitrate with, that is sodium nitrate with metallic lead. Then the specific gravity of sodium nitrite is 2.168. Next question, when exposed to atmosphere, sodium nitrite get oxidized to sodium nitrate. Then question number 6, sodium nitrite is used as an antidote in the treatment of answer, cyanide poisoning. Then sodium nitrite appears as yellowish or white crystalline powder. Then 8, sodium nitrite is known for its role in inhibiting the growth of answer clostridium botulinum spores that's why it is used as a preservative in bottled food that means sodium nitrite is used as an antidote and also as a preservative then bottle cheyda food il develop cheyan chance ulla oru bacteria aanu clostridium botulinum Next question name the compound used along with sodium nitrite in cyanide poisoning answer sodium thiosulfate cyanide poisoning le sodium nitrite and sodium thiosulfate ee rendu compounds inde mori combined therapy aanu use cheyyunathu next one sodium nitrite is used as an antidote in cyanide poisoning due to its ability to induce answer methemoglobin formation then next question the methemoglobin get combines with cyanide ions to produce answer cyan methemoglobin which protect the essential enzymes from cyanide ions that means sodium nitrite cyanide poisoning il or antidote aite use cheyumbol undagavuna or chemical process aanu paranjathu sodium nitrite cyanide poisoning il or antidote aite use cheyanulla kaaranam adine methemoglobin formation induce cheyanulla kalivundu ennalladu kondana ingane form cheyda methemoglobin cyanide ions umayitt combine cheyidu undagunathu cyan methemoglobin enna oru compound aanu actually that compound helps to counteract the negative effects of cyanide ions okay let's check out some extra points from the topic The cyan methemoglobin dissociates setting free cyanide which is converted to thiocyanate by sodium thiosulfate. Cyanide poisoning ile as an antidote sodium thiosulfate inde role aanu parayunnathu. Cyan methemoglobin formation shesham free cyanide thiocyanate aayittu convert cheyana with the help of sodium thiosulfate. Ini combination therapy ude dose kudi paranjittunde adu ingane aanu 10 ml of sodium nitrite injection is given iv during 3 minutes. followed after 5 minutes by 50 ml of sodium thiosulfate injection given iv during 10 minutes then the injections may be repeated in 2 hours if necessary 
then another point combination of sodium nitrite and sodium thiosulfide is also effective as an antidote in lead bismuth mercury and iodine poisoning then sodium nitrite is incompatible with acetanilate antipyrin phenazone caffeine etc then in his solubility team storage team karyam kudi paranjittunde that is sodium nitrate is freely soluble in water and sparingly soluble in alcohol and it should be stored in air tight containers due to its deliquescent nature okay itrem points mathramana ee topic il antidotes il varunathu ini next inorganic official compounds of iron iodine and calcium first of all you can go through the questions Next compound is ferrous sulfate. Question number twelve. Ferrous sulfate is called answer green vitriol. Then iron vitriol is the synonym for answer ferrous sulfate. And ferrous sulfates is answer ferrous sulfate. That means ferrous sulfate in the moona synonym are green vitriol, iron vitriol, and ferrous sulfates. Next question: Chemical formula for ferrous sulfate. Answer: Fe SO4 7H2O. Next question: Ferrous sulfate is prepared by adding excess iron to answer dilute sulfuric acid. Then question number 17: Ferrous sulfate occurs as answer green crystals. Then 18: When exposed to air, ferrous sulfate get oxidized to become brown color. Next question: On exposure to air, ferrous sulfate get coated with answer ferric sulfate, which is brown in color. Then ferrous sulfate is freely soluble in water and it is insoluble in alcohol. Then it should be definitely stored in an airtight container. Then question number twenty-one: Ferrous sulfate is used in the treatment of anemia that is caused by iron deficiency. That is ferrous sulfate in the original color or light green color. Are no. In the air, my te direct contact with it. Anangil ferrous sulfate, ferric sulfate. I maran la chance under. So, other te color brown are no. Adu under thanni are no ferrous sulfate. Or air tight tight la containeril sukshi ke nam enda parai na the. Air my te direct contact with it. Anangil green color brown I te maran da ik anan sadhikum. Adu under thanni laboratory purpose le ferrous sulfate freshly prepared I te matra mane use ke na the. Next question: Dried ferrous sulfate occurs as answer grayish white powder. Then question number twenty-three: Dried ferrous sulfate are dispensed as sugar coated tablets. Okay, next compound is iodine. Question number twenty-four. Chemical formula for iodine. Answer I two. Then question number twenty-five. Iodine is an essential ion necessary for the synthesis of two thyroid hormones. Which are they? Answer: Leothyronine and thyroxine. Leothyronine is also called triiodothyronine, and inadequate or excess secretion of these hormones result in hypothyroidism or hyperthyroidism. Actually, these hormones are basically iodine-containing amino acids. Then, question number twenty-six: Lack of sufficient iodine in the diet may lead to answer: simple goiter. 
Okay, then let's check out some extra points from the topic. The size of the thyroid gland is inversely proportional to the iodine content of the gland. Then the wide spectrum of disorders caused by the inadequate iodine consumption are known as iodine deficiency disorders. Then the deficiency of iodine in pregnant women can cause irreversible brain damage of the baby. Then the next point, in 1962, the government of India initiated the National Goiter Control Program which in 1992 was renamed as National Iodine Deficiency Disorders Control Program that is NIDDCP. Next question from the topic calcium gluconate. Question number 27 give the synonym for calcium gluconate. Answer calcium glucone or calli gluconase. Next question chemical formula for calcium gluconate. Answer C12H22O14 CAH2O. Then question number 29 calcium gluconate is prepared by boiling the solution of gluconic acid with slight excess of calcium carbonate. Then question number 30 calcium gluconate is used as a answer calcium replenisher. Ok then I have some related points from the same topic. Calcium gluconate occurs as white crystalline powder then it is odorless and tasteless. It is freely soluble in boiling water and insoluble in alcohol. Then calcium gluconate is incompatible with oxidizing agents, citrates, sodium carbonate, phosphates and sulfates. Then it is an important source of calcium in the treatment of hypocalcemic tetany. Then it is available in the form of calcium gluconate tablets or injection. And the route of administration of injection may be IV or IM that is intravenous or intramuscular injection. Ok let's moving on to the final topic from the session that is calcium. 99% of body calcium is found in bones then the atomic number of calcium is 20 and the atomic weight is 40.08. Then the total amount of calcium in the human body is 22 gram per kilogram body weight. And the best food source of calcium is milk and milk products. Then the deficiency of calcium is called hypokalemia. Then its deficiency may lead to rickets in children, osteoporosis, osteomalacia, tetany etc. Then the last point excess calcium is called hyperkalemia. Okay, in the session you have seen that there is a portion of the points that are in the diploma level. Okay then video useful आनंद तो उन्हें आने के लिए तेरे चाहिए हम लाइक किया नहीं शेयर किया नहीं मरी किया था वीडियोस इन तेरे लिए फ्रेंड्स ने मेरे शेयर किया ना प्लीज तू सब्सक्राइब द चैनल फॉर मोर वीडियोस थैंक यू सो मच